it is that time again. Did you know that it's that time again? What time is it? Showtime! With like lights up. Like I said. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, this is Matthew. And this is Andrea. Welcome back to another card unboxing, or I guess it's a box break in some cases, but yeah. it's no actual card box break. here. We're going to break some cards. Or well, maybe we shouldn't, because these are your cards. No, actually, yeah, I'd be really pissed if something happened to them. Yeah, so what we have here today, Andrea, is the cards that you bought. Yeah, so I actually know what they are. All right, it's the Lights of Broadway. You've seen us do it in the past. Now we're back with the newest set. It is the Autumn 2018 edition, and I purchased these bad boys and girls at Broadway Con. That's right, and you don't need to be John Lawrence, because today this is the place to be. We got Ooh. eight packs to open, so why don't we get on that Oh, we're going to stop. for that. free? No, 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 no. We're going to stop making this I was this doing any... all right. No, we all were right. not doing all right. We, we were doing terrible. Okay, look, we got let's cards. Open some cards. Yeah, we, we got cards. We're going to open them. You're going to like them. All right, so let's cut to the overhead, and let's start breaking some boxes. Cards. Sure, that too. Pack. Card packs. Let's break some card packs. Yeah, there we go. All right, so we've got ourselves eight packs of Autumn 2018 Edition Lights of Broadway cards. Yay! And there's five cards in each of these packs. So that's 40 cards. That sounds like math. We did math. All right, so I'm going to take this half. I'm going to take this half. Let's open them. I'm so excited. Would you like to go first? Oh, let's show them. So you guys can see also the color scheme too as well, because uh, every time it's different. So this is a blue and yellow scheme. Mm -hmm. Here's the, the back. back. I love the back, because you always get that little teaser of what's about to expect. Yeah. It's always nice. All right, let's go ahead and open these up. <laughs> Jeez, dude. Okay, and... I got the Ferryman, the show. I got Ariel Satch Stashel. Um, okay, John Ellis Conley. Ooh, Gerard Canoncio. I hope I pronounced that correctly. And from the Ensemblist collection, Jennifer, excuse me, Jennifer Cody. Uh, um. Real quick, I don't know if we've mentioned this before, the Ensemblist collections are, um, these are literally people who spend their time in the ensemble. And I think there's even a podcast about them because you wouldn't have a show without the ensemble. All right, and now I have, starting things off, I have Karen Morrow. I have now Austin Pendleton. Ooh, I like this card. We've got Kate Reindeer, Reindeers? Reindeers? <laughs> <laughs> Reindeers. That's a fun name. Jelani Aladdin or Aladdin? Jelani... <laughs> Aladdin. That's also a very cool name. And, ooh, Hermione Gingold? <laughs> Hermione Gingold. I got two names out of five correct so far. <laughs> okay. It's going to be a good night for Matthew. But this is from um, the Golden Age collection, which is pretty darn awesome. Yeah, we'll show you what those look like. There's a difference. So they're, clearly, they are gray on the back, whereas <laughs> the others are, in this case, they're blue and yellow. Or black. Or black, black and blue. Black and blue. And let's see if the ensemble is any different also. Uh... White? Yeah, all right. So, so yeah, there are a little bit of ways to tell the difference. Um, but it's cool about the... Um, I love the Golden Age stuff because these are like the classic, the people that everybody knows pretty much. Yeah. So that's just fun. So that's the first two packs. Let's put yours now in uh, the midsection. Okay, next row. I'll we'll start with Mike Faced. Dear Evan Hansen. This one I'm super excited about. Summer, the Donna Summer musical. Because she works hard for the money. Ooh, Big River. Right here, put that there. Kevin Adams. And, oof, I grew up loving this woman. I still do. Um, you're, you, We all know her. It's Felicia Rashad. Ah, oh, wow. I'm excited about that one. And uh, you know, we're only 15 cards in, but let's look at the variety of colors you get. I love the color schemes. Like, the color schemes just make me happy. It's still the same artist doing all these pictures. Yeah, I mean, Squigs um, is amazing. Yeah. So, you know, it, it kind of is like that Al Hirschfeld style yeah, of drawing. Very much so. Cool. Um, all right, so let's let's keep going. So, yeah, basically, if you've gotten a few packs, you kind of know what to expect out of the artwork. And if you're a fan, you'll love them. If not, well, you're yeah. watching the wrong video. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> all right, so now here's my pack. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. No pressure, no pressure, no pressure. Ooh, what? Well, well uh, You're just getting lucky today. Wow. I got off the top. Well, we'll start, I guess, this way. I got Teresa Rebeck. Teresa Rebeck. Oh, she's done like a lot of stuff. Oh, Jessica Voss. So she was at Broadway Con. 
Um, and I think I believe she was at Broadway Con, and she's just really awesome, and people seem to absolutely adore her. <gasps> Whoa! Yeah. Oh, Kiara Alegria Juarez. Juarez, is that I who I think that is? <gasps> Ooh, she was. Yep, L- L- I believe it was Lynn wrote the lyrics. She wrote because the C says her Broadway debut in the Heights. She's awesome. Put that over there. Oh, now I'm super excited. Uh, oh, I got, all of a sudden, that's what? a nice card. Fences. Oh, wow. That looks like it's James Earl Jones, yeah, I was gonna right? Say, yeah, because um, James Earl Jones was like the definitive stage version, but then there's Denzel who yeah. came around, and he was awesome, and he directed the movie. Yeah, I like this, this drawing. <laughs> that's, that's a good drawing. It's very that, different from the others. That is so perfect. It really captures personality, though. Oh, one. my God. Where was this when I was studying Fences every semester when I went was in college? <laughs> <laughs> and finally, I got another one of these gray cards. This is Irving Berlin. Golden Age cards. Sure. And yes, it's Irving Berlin, which is so cool. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to the next pack. Oh, my I'm God. just going to start stacking these on top of each other until we uh, get them all done. And we're going to start off with, my in it, Howard McGillen. Awesome. Raymond J. Lee. Ooh, J. Armstrong Johnson. I love the eyebrows. The eyebrows are just so spot on. Oh, Tracy Toms. I'm. Oh my God, I'm such a huge fan of hers. She she was um she took over the role of Joanne in the Rent movie. That would be sort of where a lot of people know her from. Um, but she's done so much other stuff. And God, her voice is so good. And John Shivers. Mm. Let's see who you got. Dun, dun, dun. If you get another Golden Age, I will laugh yeah. really hard. Laugh or be jealous. Both. But they're all coming home with me, so I'm less jealous. Why can't you open these though? Oh my god! Be jealous. Oh my god, how is this happening? Be jealous. Now, now we need to know if it's a dude. Oh, Eden Espinosa! I got Eden Espinosa. He's got Bonnie <laughs> Milligan. To go with your Bonnie and Clyde! Uh-huh, look at that. Get I really on. like the show cards the best. Those are I the do best. Too. I love the show cards. D. Hody. Wow, and. And yes, it is a double. I got two Irving Berlins. Wow. So you got some trade fodder now. Oh, totally. Yeah, that's good. It's okay. good to have, though. Oh, yeah, we're going to trade so hard. Okay. Let's see now uh, what you have. We okay. have one pack each left, I believe. <laughs> yes, we do. Let's open them together. Oh. Let's do a double pack open. Maybe this time you have, I was just going to say, <laughs> you, have card this, you have the golden age oh, this time. I got the golden age this time, but what? Let, what if I, I also have a golden age? You I do. do. I wonder if that's changed, like maybe how common they are for this new. This no new, way. Or are, are we just that good at picking We're up that packs? We're that good. I think you. Let's go one at a time. Ooh. I got Bobby Cannavale. Bobby Cannavale. No, I like my way better. Okay. I got a dupe of um, Kiara. Oh, God. I'm, I'm oh, who sucks at names now? It's you. It's you. <laughs> Kiara Alegria Juarez. Okay. I got Aunt May. Yep. Okay. For those of, for our geekier fans who know, who are non-musical geeky fans, Rosemary Harris, beautiful woman that actress that she is, she it was Aunt May in the Tobey Maguire um, run trilogy of Spider-Man. Sorry, that that sounded weird, but I got um Les Proto. Just Les, just yeah. Le Proto. I'm I am sorry. Les. I am Les Proto. That's you just an obey. awesome name. I, I gotta say, I, I, Jess Le Proto. I got a very pink Kate Rockwell. Ooh. And let's put our cards down together. One, two, three. Yeah. Brian Cranston. Go fish. <laughs> got a pair of Brian Cranston. <laughs> How does that happen? <laughs> That's awesome. I got Will Rowland. And now we each have a Golden Age card to wrap things up. Yeah. Excuse us, Brian Cranston. Uh, you, 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 the Brian Cranston brothers can go over there. Yes. Uh, we each have a Golden Age. Yep. I got Catherine Cornell, and uh, you got Paul Robeson. Yes, I do. So Ooh. look at all these Golden Age cards we got. We got a whole Jeez. bunch of them. So yeah, like, I'm super have, excited about that. Wait, uh, do we have all these? Anything? Actually, I have the checklist here, real quick. This is the checklist. We do not have all of them, but we have many of them. Ooh, there's gonna be a Jason Robards. I want wow. that. Yes, I'm that big of a nerd. I want that. Yeah. So. This is the autumn 2018, uh, 2018 edition. I do want to show up. And uh, yes, Andrew, you also got a few cards on your own, separate from this purchase. Or... Yeah, I might have um, gotten some as soon as they came out. Yeah, you could, she couldn't wait forever for this. So I could not. So I just want to show you a few of the special cards that I really, really enjoy. Um, got Leslie Uggams, um, Michael Crawford, Be More Chill and Smash, you know, awesome dude. 
you know, you're a writer, a creator, be more chill. Uh, I'll be more chill and smash. Um, Joe Iconis, he's kind of awesome. Another ensemblist, um, Rosanna. Um, is it Rosina? Beats me. I'm sorry if I'm butchering your name. You got your card and we like it though, so that's cool. Yeah, um, M. Hill Jackson. Like, really, she looks beautiful, and I feel also. She has I feel a very awful. pointy chin. Uh, that, I'm pretty sure that's an artist thing. Not, not. It doesn't have a point like that. But what if she did, though? She could, like, etch her name onto That'd be card. awesome, and I'd want her to autograph stuff with her shit. Yeah, that'd be cool. God, this is an awful thing to say. <laughs> <laughs> We're terrible people. Just you. Really? You're the one who talked about pointing your name. So what, anyway. what else do you have there? <laughs> so this is one of the honors cards. This is for the Jimmy Awards. This is for high schoolers and younger people. And, in fact, um... The gentleman who is going into Dear Evan Hansen, Andrew... Oh, gosh, I wish I could remember his name, but... Not well, Andrew Dice Clay. No. Oh, I don't know why I'm thinking Andrew Barth, but I'm pretty sure I'm butchering it, so I'm so sorry. But from what I understand, he 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 um, won at the Jimmy Awards. He won the very first um, lip sync battle at Broadway Con. He's about to become Dear Evan Hansen, and he hasn't graduated high school. He is crazy talented. And like I said, Jimmy Awards, this is how people get to know him. And finally, because... We're geeks on all sorts of levels, and because I just think this card is hilariously awesome, Daniel Radcliffe. <laughs> You're a wizard, Harry. Be my phantom. Be my phantom. <laughs> you know, they really need to make a Mario Cantone card. For, oh, I think I have. Because, like, whenever I see Michael Crawford, I can't help but think of Mario Cantone in Steam Pipe Alley. Or whatever. Oh, yeah. That's terrible. The Phantom Man can. I believe there is a Mario Kart. But I want a pair of, of them together. Squigs, if you see this and you hear this, please. I mean, I really just want a, a deck of Mario Cantone cards and various <laughs> things. That's really all I want. No, I don't think you should have that, but I do like the idea of having, like, iconic duet couples. That would be cool, yeah. Oh, that, yeah, that duets, actually, that's a good yeah, idea. Yeah, that would be kind of a fun thing to have. It's kind of like these, but just specifically duets. That'd yeah, be like people who do... who he, Like, there are definitely couples who you just can't help but see. I know for the Giving Back one um, of this... Right. Real quick, for, for this set uh, on the Giving Back cards, um, there's a Marin Maisie and Jason Donnelly um, card. Marin unfortunately passed recently, which really sucks. But I love the idea of, you know, a card with couples or duets and duets. You have like stuff. Michael Crawford and Sarah Brightman, right? Yeah. Yeah. Stuff yeah. Like that, or... yeah, absolutely. Sarah Borellis and any of her, the, the guys that she's been hanging out with in Waitress. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we could just have a lot of fun doing that. So oh, that... Adina Menzel and Kristen Chenoweth. There you go. Yeah, that would be a good one. So there you go. That is a look at some of the Lights of Broadway show cards from the Autumn 2018 edition. I may have more at home that we're not showing you because we don't have the time. No, but this is just a little sneak peek. You gotta buy yours if you want to see everything in the entire set. <laughs> and you gotta buy a lot if you want to get them all. Yeah, and if you want to learn more about Lights of Broadway show cards, if you want to learn more about the Lights of Broadway show cards, go to thelightsofbroadway.nyc. Yeah, seriously, if you like Broadway, you're gonna like these cards. These cards are awesome. Um... I'm a huge fan. I know there are people who are way bigger fans than me out there who, who literally have completed all of the different editions and as well they should. They're just fun. Go out there, try and get them. The more you buy, the more likely we can get more of them at in more store retail spaces too. Because sometimes it's hard to order online, but if we can get them into more shops, oh, game over, man. Game over. <laughs> mm. Well, creepy hands aside, uh, <laughs> this is your Lights of Broadway Autumn 2018 edition. Yeah, I can't wait till fall. No, I can't wait for spring 2019 to oh, come yeah. out. Yeah, so yeah, you got some time before then, but in the interim, there's plenty of other cards to collect. So oh, yes. start spending your money. And uh, if you don't want to buy these cards, that's fine. Just send your money to Andrea and she'll buy them. Absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm the voice of Matthew. I'm the voice of Andrea. And these are the Lights of Broadway show cards once again. We like them. If you like Broadway and you're not buying them, what's wrong with you? Yeah, seriously. Yeah, get on that. Change that up. So we'll see you guys next time for some more toys, cards, and I don't know, stuff. See? Cool stuff. Yeah, hope so. Fun stuff. And make sure to like, share, and subscribe because if you don't, we can't make videos. And if we can't make videos, we're going to cry a lot. So yeah. much crying. And whining. There'll be so much whining. Especially from Andrea.
Oh, listen to you. You should t- listen to yourself sometimes. Well, good night, America. Bye.